In this Dundee neighborhood, Mark Von Drosik lives with his two roommates. My hours at work have been reduced. Um, my two roommates are on unemployment. His household has been hit hard by the current pandemic. He says his landlord knows about their financial struggles, but that hasn't stopped questions about rent. And has been nagging us constantly and sort of bombarding us with calls about you've got to pay rent, you've got to do it this way. Uh, there's no exceptions. Back in March, Governor Ricketts issued an executive order to postpone evictions until the end of May for those whose jobs were impacted by the coronavirus. But with time ticking down, Von Drosik is concerned not only about evictions, but how that could spread the virus. Being evicted puts you in contact with other people. You have to move, you have to go and look at other apartments, and that spreads the disease faster. This comes as people across the nation are asking that landlords cancel rent and to not threaten evictions during this pandemic, including in Omaha. A complete cancellation of rent, ensure that no back rent is owed when all this is over, a halt to evictions completely for any reason. Simon Hinton of Omaha Tenants United, which is fighting for those changes, says he's still seen some landlords threatening evictions even before the end of May and is confused by that process. And I don't know what land, how landlords expect to refill those apartments during this time of crisis. Who else is going to come in and pay for those? They're asking for something for free. Nothing is free. Everything comes at a cost. But some property owners are pushing back at the ideas, including Arnold Epstein. I don't have a pension. I need the rent. I have a disabled adult son. I have to pay his housing, his medical issues. I, have to, I need money to support him. Von Drosik says his household paid half their rent for March and April, and the other halves will be paid down the road, something which he's not looking forward to. We're going to have to you know, work 110, 120, 150 percent harder to pay back that rent uh, at our jobs in the f near future. In response, Governor Ricketts says he's reviewing those executive orders. No word if the mandate regarding evictions will be extended at this time.